you never know in the beginning where things are going to go. And um, all, uh, all you can really do is ground yourself in, in a, a core direction or vision, hopefully with something significant if you're an inventor that you can bring to solve the problem and then, then try to constantly listen. Since 2005, the Satarja Center for Entrepreneurship and Technology at UC Berkeley has inspired entrepreneurs and innovators to positively change the world. Its acclaimed Berkeley method of instruction takes students on a journey to leverage proven frameworks build their networks and ecosystem, and shift toward a growth mindset. We're all living in a world that's changing quickly, and there's a certain amount of adaptation that everyone, um, every company has to do. And so you need a certain type of broad thinking mindset. You need to be comfortable with a wider comfort zone. You know, all of those things um, the pivots that you're going to go through and not really caring about if, it's, if it didn't go right, trying it again, trying it in a different way. Those are all um, the behaviors that you need. My very first uh, social group and job out of graduate school literally was with a um, software startup that was founded by um, a UC Berkeley professor and had a number of people from Soda Hall. I was lucky after graduate school to meet these folks and get recruited into their company. And the mindset at that time was that we are going to take the really the, the frontier of distributed systems research and we're going to use it to improve the quality and the performance and the capability of the internet for um, content applications. I was lucky to become part of that and to really see this blend between the, the just the, the, the most forward points of research and what was known as possible and then trying to bring that into reality in startups. I uh, started a company called Aspera at the beginning of my career and I ended up uh, selling that company to IBM and in the process of seeing it grow even more um, really saw some of the problems of video over the internet at scale and then blockchain came. And as I was leaving IBM and thinking about what I wanted to, to work on along with some of my colleagues, we ended up creating the Content Fabric, which is a decentralized blockchain platform for all forms of digital IP or content and continued to deepen what we were doing with Blockchain at Berkeley, joined the Accelerator program. What we're doing at Alluvio, number one, we are in a, a combination of both execution to bring out capabilities and features on our core technology to meet the needs of that creator economy and on the other side also discovery uh, experimentation with models everyone benefits from some innovation behavior within the scope of what you're doing you're still open to the right level of adaptation that amount of innovation behavior and intensity it's changing it's like it's a lot in the beginning and it's slowly reducing and you know and now it's becoming more about reliability perfection and scale later on i think having a wide view across multiple disciplines is really foundational and then then try to constantly listen as to how you can refine and apply that to meet the evolving needs that are that are around you and people talk about pivoting i mean i think that's that's a very superficial you know definition of what actually goes on in terms of of, of making new technology and innovating i mean the whole thing is a it, it, it's a continuous pivot. 